And after our last meal, after lunch, we will be going our separate ways and rejoin our communities. More than two and a half days, wonderful days of being in this place, wonderful holy place where the Lord has enveloped us has inspired us, has imparted on us what he wishes us to carry forth. In the, in the preceding days, there are many things that we are most unworthy and yet we have received. There are many realizations learnings and discoveries. And those for the last time probably not once some of you would want. Again I would like to invite you to say your own personal, your short prayers of thanksgiving, acknowledging his goodness, the Lord's presence in you these days. Once again focusing on my eyes mag-alay ng pasasalama, mag-alay po ang inyong panalami, at tapusin po ito ng salamat, Panginoon, salamat. Ulitin po natin. Salamat, Panginoon, salamat. At narito na po siya upang pakinggan ang ating mga nakataming panalami ng pasasalama. Anybody can be here. Salamat.
salamat sa mga darating pang mga biyaya, Panginoon. Salamat, Panginoon. Salamat. Salamat, Panginoon. Salamat. Salamat din po sa mga naghanda ng aming pagkain. Salamat, Panginoon. Salamat. Salamat, Panginoon. Salamat. Salamat, Panginoon, sa inyong pagsusugo sa aming ngayon. Salamat din sa pagkataya at paglagawa ng lahat ng aming pagkakaroon. Pagkakaroon kami, ito na yung aming mahalag na bahagi ng simbaan ng aming mag-aaral at bakaya na sa aming mga kapatid. Salamat din. Kalusugan ko na pinagkaloob niya sa amin. Nawa ang amin kong mga agam-agam at takot ay maging lakas na nanggagaling po sa inyo upang kami po ay makaganap sa tungkulin ng yatang sa amin. Salamat, Panginoon. Salamat. Salamat, Panginoon. Salamat. Dear Lord, all our words are very insufficient. Words are ineffable to describe the feelings of our hearts, of what our sentiments are deep inside us. Thank you for this chance. Thank you for this opportunity that we have mustered enough strength and courage to be close to you. Continue to abide in us. Continue to give us the consolation that we are continuing the church that we have established, that we are reaching out to those who want us, you want us to reach out to, the poor, the enemy, 
the marginalized of our society, and make our church in the Philippines a shining beacon of faith to all the other peoples in the world. And we ask this in the name of Jesus, your Son, together with the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. Let us pray. Nourished by these redeeming gifts, we pray, O Lord, that through this, this help to eternal salvation, true faith may ever increase. We ask this to Christ our Lord. Amen. I'll ask the Sister Nietzsche to take over. <coughs>